Welcome to York for the Judd Monty International. It's a big chance for the three-year-olds to meet the older horses over the classic distance of a mile and two. This is a group one for three-year-olds and up. And attacks for D. Thompson, Ballesteros Sen Senator, Steve Rand, and Costa about for John. Vesovian for D. Thompson, Dancing Goddess and Endless Nights, both six to one for Leon Van Rensburg. Gunrunner for Dan Hughes, Pyromaniac for Django, ultimately cool for Paul Rhodes, your 72 favourite. Zero Tolerance also for Paul Rhodes, Brief Alec Carver for John, Cruise on by for C. Beckwith, Putty and Bargain for Vinnie Gerard, Quantity Surveyor for Hems, Ring em All Beach for Dan Hughes, Fawns and Quid for David Ad, 16 go to post in the Group 1 Judd Monty International, and they're off. And it's a good start from Gunrunner for Dan Hughes on the rail, Brief Alec Carver. Dancing Goddess is also going to try and make the running. Putty and Bargain for Vinnie Gerard is making their way across to join Dancing Goddess, who's in front for Leon Van Rensburg. It's Dancing Goddess from Putty and Bargain. Masovian, the Group 1 winner, in behind them in third. Brief Alicaba leads the pack with also in Costa about. Ballesteros Senator. Um, Quantity Surveyors also on the premises with the favourite ultimate call in the middle. On the outside, Cruise on by with Thornton Quid. They're followed by Ringamall Beach, Andra Tix, Gun Runner, Endless Nights, Zero Tolerance, and Pyromaniac is at the back. Six finals left to go. We're halfway here at York in the Judd Monty International, and Chance Dancing Goddess is still in front for Leon Van Rensburg, followed by Putty and Bargain for Vinnie Gerard and Sovian for D. Thompson. These three making the best of their way home currently. The favourite ultimately call for Paul Rhodes is up into fourth here, and is starting to stalk the leaders. Dancing Goddess has decided the pace is too slow and is starting to kick on now. And Dancing Goddess, as they enter the straight here at York, with four finals left to go. And Costa about has been brought out to have a challenge, but is now dropping away as they come at Dancing Goddess. It's Dancing Goddess from Putty and Bargain. Ballesteros Senator ultimately cool. Well, you've got Quantity Surveyor also staying on the two. John Morgan horses are still on the premises. Two furlongs left to go and Dancing Goddess has got them at it in the Judd Monty International. It's Dancing Goddess for Leon Van Rensburg. Less than two furlongs left to go. About two lengths clean from the Soviet Quantity Surveyor. Thornton Quick, Brief Alicaba, Ballesteros Senator. Now they're closing on Dancing Goddess. It's Masovian. Zero tolerance for Paul Rose. Endless Knight in the middle. Early on that red spot. Endless Knight is going to win the Judd Monty. Endless Knight. Hold on. From zero tolerance. Masovian was there. And Costa about was there. It might have been a bit closer than I made out there. With zero tolerance coming back on the line. But Endless Knight, I'm pretty certain, has won the Judd Monty. Multiple time Group 1 winner does it again in one of the biggest races of the year at 11 to 2. The six year old mare beats the Paul Rhodes three year old. It's big for a three year old to be up there in the Judd Monty. Zero Tolerance was second at 12 to 1. Masovian was third at 8 to 1. And Costa about was fourth at 14 to 1. And Andertix was fifth for D. Thompson at 40 to 1.